Fact number 11. Joseph possibly received a revelation on polygamy in Kirtland as he translates the Bible. With the Lord's Law revealed and the saints from New York gathering to Ohio, Joseph and Sidney resumed the inspired translation of the Bible. They moved on from the account of Enoch to the story of the patriarch Abraham, whom the Lord promised to make a father of many nations. The Lord did not reveal extensive changes to the text, but as Joseph read Abraham's story, he pondered much about the patriarch's life. Why had the Lord not condemned Abraham and other Old Testament patriarchs for marrying multiple wives, a practice Bible-reading Americans abhorred? The Book of Mormon provided one answer. In the days of Jacob, Nephi's younger brother, the Lord commanded Nephite men to have only one wife. But he also declared that he could direct them otherwise if circumstances required it, to raise up righteous children. Joseph prayed about the matter, and the Lord revealed that he sometimes commanded his people to practice plural marriage. The time to restore the practice was not yet, but a day would come when he would ask some of the saints to do so.